Today we are going to discuss about Robert Koch's history contribution and his postulate. So Robert Koch lived between 1843 to 1910. Robert Koch is also known as father of bacteriology, also a physician and a microbiologist. He was the first to prove that microorganism was the cause of an infectious disease the first person okay so now we are going to discuss about his contributions he gave the simple staining techniques okay the stain we do in our labs today these stains can be used as a quick and easy way to determine cell shape size and arrangements of bacteria the second contribution was he was the first one to give first photo micrograph of bacteria as well as bacteria in deceased tissue disease means dead tissue he gave technique for estimating cfu per ml cfu is colony forming unit he gave the use of steam sterilized media use of petri dishes technique to transfer bacteria he the very most important thing that he discovered anthrax bacillus in 1876 and tubercle bacillus in 1882 and cholera vibrio in 1883 the most important part is this we are going to discuss about koch's postulates a german microbiologist robert koch proposed a set of rules for establishing a connection between a microbe and a disease now what he gave in his postulate was that microorganisms are isolated from dead animals and then these microorganisms are grown in pure culture later these microorganisms are identified and then microorganisms are injected into healthy animals now diseases reproduce in second animal microorganisms are grown in pure culture identification of identical microorganisms So these were the postulates hope you understood as i have assembled it in very simple form for you to write in the exam thanks for watching do share subscribe hit the bell icon